G'day and welcome back to Stitch Up and episode 7 of Porter Stitch, our new region in Cities Skylines. So, um, just a couple of things uh, off camera that I did. Um, so, at the end of last episode, we just finished creating the new industrial area in the Triangle Precinct. And then, I just wanted to let you know I have um, off camera at the end of the episode, I've just adjusted um, this. I think these two were quite straight and these two were curved. Um, I don't mind that it's bigger on this side and smaller on this side and I re the reason for that is because these two do not line up at right angles so I think that's pretty cool um, these are really parallel which is great um, so that's nice everything sort of working out nicely now the traffic is crazy over here in the new area and I think this is because we've got everyone trying to get there by car and no one can um, I think people are trying to travel to work by car as well as all the goods are trying to travel by car so or by road so i think that we once we put our tram in we should be good so let's uh 195 7000 yeah i'm gonna put it on here for the um, pause for the moment because we do need to expand expand our residential but i think we can get the tram line in first um all right so let's have a look at tram line the first line is what's that is that tram yeah so the first line does this. Um, what do you got there? These are the roads, buildable tram roads. Okay, so the first line does uh, this. <clears throat> comes in here, goes around there, comes in here, does a U-turn up there, and goes back there. I think the next line, we might end up having the same stops. So we might put it, um, where are the tram stops? Yeah, there they are there. We might reuse some of the stops and then have them go from here as a pickup um will they be able to go around or is that yeah actually what we might do for this one is have the tram go around here all the way down and then into the other area which could be nice and then all the way back so let's start the next line off at um well let's start it here that's another line um that's and hopefully it'd be good if it did a different color for me right now. Um, but that's fine. Uh, so we'll stop here. And then we'll stop here. Yep. All right. This tram should be able to now go, hang on. Is it on the side? Yep. These tram lines should be able to go down here using this. We not put stops on these roads yeah so you can't stop on those roads interesting so we'll go right there okay um so it uses basically that road but there's no stopping on it so that's interesting i think for that one we have to use that other road that was in the mod section uh and then here we're going to do this as um middle of the triangle right on the curve middle of the triangle right on the curve middle of the triangle and here right on the curve and then we'll go back we'll do it around this side so he should be able to come straight on there yep he doesn't need to turn around yep and then he just goes straight down using the same stops but what we might do is we'll do different stops here will we no we'll use the same stops i think that's that's the done thing stopping at university and stopping there and then he goes around oh hang on stops here yep and then he goes around and connects up all right now we'll go to change lines and this line's going to be green and we shall see how that goes so the green line there hang on oh yes yeah, so the original line's green and the new line is purple Actually, let's do the original line as purple and the new line as green. Uh, yeah. Let's make it nice and bright, please. Um, that should be good. And press play. And we'll see here. So. Let's see the trams go. Okay, just gonna jump out there. So those trams are, there's one of the new Melbourne trams, lovely. And off he goes. 
So sending quite a few trams out now to get that going. So we'll see if this makes a difference throughout this episode on traffic here. All this traffic on the freeway, all this is absolutely ridiculous, this traffic. Um, so we're hoping all that is fixed. Okay, so we got that happening. Um, and that should get some workers there. I've got to remember to leave a railway reservation as well. Um, <clears throat> but we'll start, start, let's start building some other parts of this area. So we want residential, and I think we can have some more residential here. Um, although we do think we need some residential down there. Actually, I'm going to just go and buy this tile. And we might be able to continue with this residential. Yeah. Okay, let's have a look. So we go up. And we want to buy this one, please. 83,000. That's a lot. Um, let's have a look. Yeah, that's pretty good. Happy with that. Uh, all right, cool. So, um, mm, I'd have to redo those tram lines if I fix this. But I think I do fix that anyway. I think it's worth fixing. Um, oh, God, I'm going to have to redo both tram lines. What I might do is just get, um, so it's going to be, where is it? It's going to be this one with just tram and tram. Yeah, it's going to be this one. So I might do it as that and we'll connect them up a little bit later. Let's actually do a straight area like this. And what we might do as well is like this. And then curved areas. Yep. And we'll do it like that, leaving room for a turnaround. Um, which is nice. These guys can connect up a little bit later. And now we can start putting in a road grid. So um, just going to keep it on. It's on speed one. Um, so let's start getting a nice little grid out. Uh, so we want to use this one with the grass. And what we'll do is let's go like this. And then we might see if we can do this one all the way there like that yeah that maximizes the grid space there which is nice and let's go like this and like this we do want this quite full so we're just getting a little bit of extra kind of extra areas there that are connecting up nicely. Um, and then from here on in, the transition's got to be interesting here. So we might do this like this and this and this. And then we'll go up here at the angle. Because I do want this fairly full. just maybe do that across there yeah let's just connect those across um, so that's good and then we might go like this um, get some blue there for a minute and we got a little bridge there which is nice Connect these two up um, like this. Hang on. Let's go across a bit more. Connect up. Yeah, and you guys connect there. Uh huh. Okay. Um, that's a lot of intersections there, isn't it? Yeah, we've got to be careful with those roads because it does create some big intersections there, which is interesting. Actually, what we might do is just go take this one out. And then that takes that little in section out, which is nice. Um, cool. And come back to here and we'll do a few more. 
connect up to that intersection again and that should be enough there i'm gonna make all this um high density residential and we'll see how that goes could be interesting um not gonna make any adjustments to the tram lines just yet trams are really banked up here which is interesting why aren't they going this tram here is holding up. These trams look great. What's going on with the trams, guys? Waiting on the green light? Yeah. Um, has it helped anything? Oh, yeah, I think it has helped because this, I mean, that's still a lot of people up there waiting to use those roads. Uh, I think we just need to wait a little bit longer for that to happen. The trams really need to feed into the area as well, which is going to be interesting get all that happening okay let's just get let's just f keep keep going on that uh, one area so we'll do water pipes and let's go like this and then let's go like this um, and that and then from here we're just going up all pretty good we haven't done the other part yet but that's okay um, and now we'll start to work out exactly where we want to zone so uh, let's go high density and we want to don't want to zone anywhere on that so what I might do is is just zone those high density um, then I want to zone these guys um, do that, which is going to be interesting because it's trying to zone off the back of that. Um, and I might just zone here. Don't want to overdo the zoning. Uh, let's go. Actually, we will go like this. And then on this one, we'll do it like this. Yep. And we'll do those a bit bigger. Okay, so we won't overdo that. And now. We want to do some, just a bit of zoning along here. Not heaps though. Right, and maybe, maybe like this. Okay, let's just do that. Um, these cars getting across here are going to have interesting time though because they're going to have to come down here to get down there so it could be interesting lots of building going on that road's going to get really busy really quickly um, and just make sure they've got enough power right let's see so got that wind farm going on there which is interesting um, that's pretty good <laughs> Yeah, power's okay for the moment, not brilliant. Water's excellent, but power, 118,000. Um, yeah, maybe I could get the other power in. Let's see what happens here. These guys here are powered up beautifully. And I think our traffic has, no, our traffic's still an issue. We've got to change the lights there. Two lanes, come guys, two lanes. Mm. Should be able to turn from both lanes. I need to adjust the lane editors, actually. So I don't know if I can do that. Can I do that from here? Let me see. Hmm. Road maintenance. Uh, traffic routes. Just roads. Two lane, one way road. Um, right. Yep, that's priority road there. No, junctions.
Okay, so that's not bad. What I've done there is I've just made it a go, and this is a stoplight, and they just go when they've got... These guys here will now just go when they've got a bit of... So there's no traffic light there. These, this is continuous flow there, um, so that's not bad. Um, and then what's happening up here is... Is this traffic light or... Yeah. So that might have helped a little bit there, because this this just this will keep flowing. I just need to get that um, mod that allows me to make them turn from both lanes, because I want two lanes of turning there, please. Um, so I will get that for the next next bit. Okay, cool. Um, so that should just keep going. Um, we'll see how that clears up in just a sec. All right, so that's that. Um, demand for all those have gone down. So now that we've got a tram line in, I wanted to start to put a few civic buildings in here as well. And I thought some churches might be really good. 139,000. So we'll go to speak to just for a sec. Um, let me see, let me see, let me see. And if we go to here, what is that? Annunciation Cathedral, 130,000. Have I got one yet? I do want a cathedral, but I just don't know if that's going to be the right one. Football stadiums are just a bit much at the moment. Uh, lots of tall buildings, but we want churches. Where are they? What are these ones? 20,000. Nice little church. Yeah. What's this one? 5,000. Village church. Okay, so let's do these two. We'll put these two churches in. Um, now, we want this to be somewhere sort of nice and central. I was thinking somewhere here could be really good. It's a cute little patch, of, patch there. I think right on that corner could be really nice. Oh, that's pretty good too. Yeah, I like that. Okay, that's good. Um, so we got that one. And now we want <coughs> um, this one. You often see two little churches on the same block, which is great. Um, so we'll do that. You know, like a little mini church. It's usually like a different denomination, but it's all sort of nice kind of church. Church. Just says church. <laughs> okay, uh, can we paint the ground? Ground resources. Don't know if we can. Can we? Rocks. Water structures. Sand. Um, I don't think so, but what we could do maybe is put some trees in. up the middle of the city a bit. It'll just fill in some nice sort of trees in the gaps here and help us to green up our city a bit. So that's not bad. Um, especially in the heart of the city. And we've got the uh, university there, so you know, I think that's kind of good to, to do that. Actually, you might just get the brush size up a bit. Tree brush. Is that costing a fortune? No. But it might give us our limit of trees though. So I don't mind that. Let's tree brush it up a bit. And we are gonna do something in the in that area. The um what is it? Yeah, I like the difference between the two trees here, that's really nice. Um I mean, is it costing heaps? No. 
think it's a mod that allows me to get unlimited trees, so I'll be getting that because this will eventually this will this will go. No, we got too many trees there. Um, so that's all. That's kind of nice though. I don't mind that. This is probably a waste of money actually because I'm putting a lot of trees in and then I'm going to end up putting other stuff there. But kind of like it because it's going to green the city right up. Um, so I think that's pretty good. It's a very sort of green city at the moment. Um, yeah, I think that's excellent. All right, let's see. These guys, have they got no power? Okay, um, you guys need power, so we might as well go straight across. should have power now so that's good and power is getting close to running out so let me just check on that so it was this one wasn't it 15,000 for another one of them right so where was the first one here yeah Did I put another one here yeah I can mm. but right next door would be good kind of let me okay there's that. So this one should go right up now. Use. Good. All right, cool. So we got the power situation. How's that? It's kind of interesting. Oh, we need water. There we go. Um, water's done. Mm-hmm. Now we've got trees here. What else? All right, let's see the situation over here. So, traffic turning off here is still doing all right, but, I mean, it's really bad though, isn't it? Yeah, it really is. It's not good. Okay. Um, how are we going to get this all? Is this death wave? Um... Town's growing at a reasonable rate. Let's see here if we get, um, see here if we just check out the park situation. Yeah, I put a few parks in there already. Um, what about schools? Education, let's have a look here. Um, 1,200 with 1,300, no schools here. And high school? 3,000 with 2,000. So if we just put another elementary school in, we'll use the nice little one. And we'll put them on the main road, please. And we'll do uh, one there. And we might as well just put another high school in at the same time. Yep. And that's good. And if we have a look at health, is excellent. Death isn't good, but I'll just put a few of these out here because I reckon we can afford to put those there. Um, might put, you know what, I'm up at two here, like this, yep, and then get some crematoria. <clears throat> What's that, a sauna? Let's get one of those in. Crematoria. Um, we'll put this down the back here. I think it might be good. Yeah, let's get three of those in. Um, see if our costs are going down. No, we've got some death. So these, we'll see if that death care takes care of a lot of this. It could be death wave. Um, let's see, waiting for transport. Yeah, it just could be death wave though. If we have a look here, the workers are good, the jobs are good. He's got high density. He's all very good. Yeah, look, see all the... All the death symbols are disappearing. Um, and I think that's pretty good. Now, this is all industrial. I think I need to start to really zone it out a bit. And putting in... So I've got that road there. Let me see what other big roads we've got. Because we can't just use those ones. What about if I do this? Grass on there as well. It's nice. So if we do this, um, we might 
do that there. Now it's one way. That means something's not straight on. That's all right. We'll just we'll go like that. Um, so that's all one way. Um, we'll see if maybe we can get these as these have got trams on them. How about these guys with trees? No, no, we want just grass. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so that's one way there. We'll do a nice big two-way street here. And I'm going to do a street right through the middle of all this. But I'm going to do it like this. And bang, bang, bang. Yep. And then we can get some little streets in there as well. But we'll make these little double one-way streets. Actually... About this, oh, yep, and maybe they can be this way. Yep, and now Just getting somewhere here. Alright. Not sure about these one-way streets, how they're going to go, though. They could cause us significant trouble. But we'll see. So I want to get a bit of uh, commercial in there. And just start to fill it out a little bit. Nice and tightly packed. Actually, that can be two way. Where are we here? So, if we go like this, we can upgrade a few of these streets now. So, if we do this, two ways. Um, which else can be two way? These guys are good. They're definitely, these guys can be two way. Um, and I reckon these guys can be two way. Yeah, and these guys, the, anything that connects in with a one-way street. Those other ones are good. Um, let's go make that one a two-way street as well. Okay, how's traffic? Traffic is good, except here is bad. Wow, it's really, look at that. Look how long the line is. Um, so we need, we need the lane, okay, we need the lane sorter immediately um, because You've got two lanes being able to exit, which is nice. And they seem to be going across here. But the trams haven't helped. Okay. Alright, cool. Um, Alright, so let's get some, some commercial in. So we'll get some water pipes in first. trying to do this a little bit of a grid in some way but I don't know if that's sort of working um, and we'll do it like that that's good enough for now and now we'll zone up some okay let's get a bit of low density in but not too much we didn't want to zone too much on that um, actually maybe what I'll do is a patch of low density there and then a patch of high density and then we can actually get some technology area in as well so we go that and then we can get some office space so everything this side of the highway can now be office but not there so you're going to be like this yep okay so that'll be good um some parks Yep, 
and a few more parks. Let's just get some smaller parks in. And I thought these were kind of small. Yeah, there we go. Don't know what I'm just, you know, getting rid of at that point. Um, right, so we'll see everything grow now. So um, I've got to think about where the train reservation is going to be. So I think we need our train area to be, gee, it could almost come along here. Our train station could almost be here, I reckon. Maybe I should put that in now then. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe I start putting train stations in and just not... Um, I need a, I need to think of a, a container train system and a passenger train system. So there's got to be two. I wonder if we put them both in this area. Hmm. I really want the container side to be over here. Okay. Let's, let's do this. Let's get a train. Yep. And we'll put a container one in and it's going to be right next to the freeway like that. But that's really uh, showing that this is not straight, this road. Actually, yeah, let's get that in. I think that's good. I think that is good. Because that means traffic can go down here. And then... I think if we do, I think that's pretty good. Um, and then on here, we want the passenger train. What's that? Train station, passenger train station. Got some stations there. Um, this can be passenger train stations. Hmm. Okay. Alright, so that's all pretty good. Um, let's just leave that for the moment. Uh, see what's happening up here. Yep, so we've got residential demand, so we'll put some in here. So high density, high density residential, please. Oh, it's bugged out. We go here, high density, thank you. And it hasn't gone to the right screen. Oh, lovely. Um, so we can fill this in with this. And we fill all these in. I think we've done that. Yeah, it is done. We just haven't got the right zoning screen because it's bugging out at the moment. That's fine. Um, so those guys are going up. Power there is going to be an issue for a second. Um, wonder if I should just fix those tram. Every time I redo some roads, I have to re redo some trams. I'll need to redo the trams. In fact, I wonder if maybe we could think, have a rethink about the tram lines anyway. Um, at the moment, let's just run these. Get them a few a bit of power. Um, what's going on there? What are you doing? Build in the middle, please. Maybe I'll just put something in there like a ambulance. Nope. Um, police. Fire's pretty good. What about police? Uh, yep. Crime rate's low. Got heaps in there already, actually. You don't need that. Is it connected? Yep. Yeah, it's connected. Don't need to put anything in. Um, right, okay. So we can see now. I just wonder if maybe we have too much. Uh, actually, I'll tell you what I might do. Yeah, I'm going to, um, this is going to be a bit controversial, but I'm going to unzone this whole area and rezone it. So I'm going to unzone this. This is going to cause a drop in something. It's going to be some fairly unhappy people. Um, maybe just this side of the road like this. And maybe everything here, but nothing in this section at the moment. Uh, get rid of you and you, and of course we've got some trees, so I'll just tree brush it just for a sec. 
Get some trees in there. Um, yeah, look, see, they're not going to grow in there because it's all dead. Okay. Let's just wait for that to kind of fix up a bit. Put some trees around here. Uh, what else trees? Can we do some different trees as well? Mm -hmm. So can I put in those ones? Yeah. Right, and we've still got this sort of area down here to see whether or not we wanted to do something. Um, Alright, gotta wait for the ground to clear up there, so that'll be good. Um, yeah, get rid of all that. Don't know if these guys are going to be okay being zoned over there on that ground. Um, what's happening here? Okay, he's going to have power issues, but he's no, the train's not really connected up anyway at this stage. Um, I wonder if maybe I should connect up the train. These guys here. What's happening up here? You guys don't have a tram line or anything? No. Oh. can get him a tram line, I guess. Um, all right, let's see if we can get any other churches in here or any other um, council buildings. So we've got these churches here, which is good. I think that's really nice. That's, that's a lovely corner, actually. Um, let's see what old, other old buildings are there. What's that one? Residential building. Ooh. Well, that's a nice shape. Yeah, that would be really good. Um, I wonder if maybe there could be good. Maybe maybe here? See the shape of it. It's got a nice curve to it. Yeah, that is quite good. But I think we can put something more prominent there. What about right here? So we said it could go here on the corner. Yep. Let's just put it there and see how it goes. Um, here's another church. Should we put another church in? Ooh. Oh, there's lots of buildings here. I forgot I downloaded all these from the workshop. The shard. We won't put the shard in just yet. Um, what's this? Department store. Would sort of suit that main street, wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, especially there. Okay. Let's put department store there. Got to watch what some of these cost as well. Um, and then we've got another nice little church here. So let's put it right next to the department store. And... That's that one, level four buildings. What's this? Belgian guild halls. Oh, these are lovely buildings. Yeah, I like these. So, um, I'll go there, but I, what's, what's on that corner? I might have to move that building. Actually, let's move him now. What is he? Crematorium. Can you move that? Yeah, where's the crematorium? Actually, crematorium can be around the corner here. Or around there. Uh, Okay, and if we go to the lofts, Belgian guild halls, can we fit them there now? No. Oh, there we go, right on the corner there, that, that would work. Um, to see here. Yeah, so this is starting to look like the old centre of the city now, lots of historic kind of buildings. Um, that's pretty good. And on the other side, so that cost us a lot, that one. That really did cost us heaps. Um, what's this one? Science Centre. Science Centre. That is massive. Cossine Building. That's Damon. The Cossine. Is that a casino? These ones here are interesting prices. Okay. There's lots of buildings here that are sort of all doable but um, 
that would fit. Um, I wonder if I should put one tower in here as well. What about one tower like this? Just a just like, you know, like they made a mistake and allowed one skyscraper and then decided not to. I suppose I could always move it, couldn't I? Um, this side of the road is just, there's nothing happening there. Yeah, that's not bad because, that's not bad because at least it's in the built up area if we have a look there. Yeah. There are other, other towers that are, you know, just a little bit smaller than it. So I think that's pretty good. Um, the church is nice tall church as well, which is great. Yeah, this is good. I'm happy with that. I think that's excellent. Um, we'll have to see what's happening over this side of town because it's just, there's not much going on. Have we not <clears throat> zoned anything here, have we? No. Just get rid of that. And I wonder if we should get rid of this. Is this road necessary? That's good. Yep. They can go. And if we zone it up, we'll just zone here, on this side, and on this side. Yep. And I'm going to zone this area um, just to see how it goes. Have we got water? Yep. So we'll see how that goes. Um, yeah, it seems to be, let's have a look here. This building's really ugly. Why is that one like that? Okay, let's move that. We don't want that. Let's put that over here. Um, in fact, let's put it right there. Yeah. Department store. I mean, it kind of probably did well as a department store there, but it, it just was in the wrong kind of area. It just seemed, right next to the freeway, it just seemed a really ugly spot. Uh, yeah, but we'll see if this building annoys me. I mean, it isn't the nicest looking building, is it? Well, we got a bit done in this episode. I think we'll wrap it up fairly shortly, but um, I think off camera, I'll just go and fix this, redo the tram lines, and I'll take you through what I've done with the tram lines um, and do the turnarounds. And then I think we've, uh, we've, kind of fixed a lot of our warning messages over here um i built on this area here and it was interesting but um it seems to have it seems to have repaired itself a fair bit the trees seem to be growing so i think the pollution has dissipated a little bit um we'll check out if the is the automatic yeah automatic's on so they should go um and the tram line at the moment is picking people up from the main road, but it's not really servicing anything around here. So this will be interesting. We might need to make one of these roads a tram line and just have it going around into that suburban bit. Um, this should be high tech areas and they are, but with a European theme to them, which is really cool. Um, and we've got our, um, we've got our lovely, uh, the, I mean, the angle is going to be interesting. That's going to really do my head in a little bit. Um, if we've got to put a train around here, then it's going to have to wrap around in some way. Um, that's our, our um, container uh, trains with the containers on them. So what we might do is we might just adjust this and head it, head it across a little bit. Um, I think, yeah, I might do that. I might, I might adjust the, the way the freeway is, but we'll see how it goes. Um, all right. I hope you've liked the episode. Leave a comment. Don't forget to like it, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode. Cheers.